With the North Star Titan still settling into its new place in the meta, we are going to wait a little bit longer before we release that advanced guide. So in the meantime, I thought you guys might like a few videos on different tactical abilities. So as per request, here is the Hollow Pilot. It doesn't make you invisible, invincible, or help in any way with mobility, so this pilot tactical is often overlooked. But what it does provide is an amazing feeling of gratification when you perfectly deceive an enemy to their death. So what exactly does Hollow Pilot do? In short, lies and deception. It produces an exact copy of your pilot, including the name and health bar. The only difference is a small, sparkly sheen that is only noticeable up close, and even then very hard to distinguish in the heat of battle. The hologram will mimic the action that you are doing when you activate the ability, be it standing, crouching, walking, running, sprinting, wall running, sliding, or even wall hanging. Unfortunately, the hologram does not fire its weapon. The hologram will now keep running if it hits most obstacles instead of just disintegrating like it used to, and it can move over very small undulations in the terrain. The mirage immediately disappears if it takes damage. The hollow pilot exists for 10 full seconds before it disappears, and you can hold up to two charges. Each charge regenerates after 15 seconds, or 12 seconds with the power cell pilot perk. Hollow Pilot is somewhat tricky to use. It doesn't help with mobility or protection, so you have to have good positioning to make up for this. What follows is a number of methods you can use the Hollow Pilot to make most of its powers of illusion. The first and most obvious application is to probe an area that you are about to move into in order to reveal enemies. By throwing the hologram across a hallway, into an open space, into the next room, or at an objective, it will most likely draw the fire of any foe lying in wait. You can then make a decision to either engage the distracted enemy, or avoid the situation if it seems too hot. Be aware though that once an enemy sees the hologram for what it actually is, which usually happens only once they shoot it, they will know your general position at the moment you sent the hologram out. So you have to either be shooting them before this point, or have already moved on. Or, they will now have the advantage. The second application of the hologram is definitely the most rewarding, and that is to set up traps for the enemy. This works well when you know roughly where the enemy is, or maybe you are being chased and pursued. Send out a hologram in a direction where your opponent would expect you to be, or expect you to come from. Then emerge a few steps behind to pounce on the enemy who has switched their attention to your decoy. This relies on good map knowledge, and also not over committing against a distracted foe only to have their teammate come and take you out. The third application of Hollow Pilot is to make crossing open terrain safer. Whenever you need to cross a gap, toss out the decoy and run nearby to it. This effectively halves your chance of getting shot at when running across open ground, as enemies have to choose to shoot either you or the decoy, and it is unlikely that they will be able to see any difference. You can also use this to help out your teammates. Finally, although nowhere near as good at it as Stim or Phase Shift, Hollow Pilot can actually be used mid-fight to distract an opponent just enough to take the kill, as demonstrated in this clip here. Although this is by no means reliable, it can save you in the heat of an intense close quarters shoot up if you're lucky. Now for some more general tips. You should be using this ability frequently, because it has short cooldowns, it can store two charges, and you don't need to save it as a get out of jail free card, because unlike phase shift, it isn't one. You will also not always see the benefits of using the Hollow Pilot directly. Just remember that every second the enemy takes to aim and shoot or pursue a decoy, they are not killing you or your team, and are more vulnerable to being flanked. So send them out often along long corridors and sidelines. So let's go to a quick recap. You can use the Hollow Pilot to probe the route ahead, lure enemies into traps, make crossing open terrain safer, and sometimes distract an enemy just enough to win a fight. You should also be spamming the decoy a lot over long sight lines to disrupt the enemy team. Trust me, when you get the use of this pilot tactical ability down pat, it is very rewarding for you and even more frustrating for your opponents. So go out and give it a go. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and check out our channel for more helpful guides for Titanfall 2.